Picture this, a group of American soldiers from Easy Company, known for their bravery and resilience, are assigned to a special mission in Germany. Their objective? Capture Hitler's famous Eagle's Nest, nestled in the picturesque town of Berchtesgaden. Now, Berchtesgaden wasn't just any ordinary place. It was the very spot where Hitler had planned his conquest of Europe. It was his retreat, where he entertained heads of state and relaxed with his inner circle. And capturing this strategic location would mean etching their names in history as the conquerors of Hitler's empire. But here's the twist. The race to capture Berchtesgaden wasn't just between the Americans. French and other Allied units were also vying for this prestigious prize. It was a battle of honor and glory, with every soldier desperate to be the one to claim victory. On April 25, 1945, the Kaelstein House, also known as the Eagle's Nest, became the target of a massive bombing raid by the Royal Air Force. However, the small house proved to be an elusive target, and instead, the nearby Berghof area suffered severe damage. Now, here's where it gets interesting. The first unit to reach the Kelstein House is still a matter of debate. Some claim it was the 7th Infantry Regiment of the 3rd Infantry Division, while others argue it was the 101st Airborne. The French 2nd Armored Division also had a presence in the area, capturing photographs before leaving at the request of the U.S. command. Imagine being one of those soldiers, standing at the entrance of Hitler's retreat. One soldier, Valenti, described the scene. Shelves lined with wines, champagnes and liqueurs, food bins stocked with canned hams, cheese and pickles. It was a surreal experience, sitting in Hitler's great room, where he once entertained world leaders and sipping his wine. Can you believe it? These brave men, who had fought their way through the horrors of war, now found themselves in the heart of the enemy's lair. And to top it all off, Valenti even convinced his buddy to take a picture of him lounging on the hillside next to Hitler's house. Talk about a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity.